Hi, I'm Vernon Shaw. And I'm Jared Rose. And we're from a little YouTube channel called Hot Pepper Gaming. And this is our field day. Hot tub. We're in a hot tub. We should probably turn the bubbles off to get good sound, shouldn't we? Thank you for that. It's like soda pop. It's sad when they go away, though. I miss them. So we've been on YouTube for about two, two and a half years now. Um, we started actually because of a funny tweet that Vernon made. I made a tweet and I was like, hey, what if uh, I started a YouTube channel where people try to review video games directly after eating hot peppers and then two people favorited it and I was like, that's enough. Oh my god, I'm shaking. Can I have the milk? Chili Meisters! <laughs> so I got together with Aaron, who unfortunately couldn't be here today, um, and we put together a pilot shoot for $20 over the weekend and then Aaron was like, hey, you know who's crazy enough to do it? Yeah. Who know? You know who's crazy and stupid and would do this for two pear ciders and half of one warm beer? Jared, Jared Rosen. Rosen. We just eat hot peppers and then review video games. It is literally that. <sighs> it's a sort of squad-based multiplayer, first-person shooter, much like Unreal Tournament 2004. A truck. So a lot of the people who end up on the channel, people who reach out to us, are who we meet through mutual friends who think we're funny enough to, to hang out with. So it's, it's been really, really cool. We've actually gotten to meet some of the nicest, strangest, coolest people because of this project. Yeah. Weirdly enough, uh, Hot Pepper Gaming is now like, it's become like this weird cultural touchstone for the games industry, which is hilarious. N did not think that was gonna happen, but thank you. The way that we figure out what games we're going to review for the channel is we, we just kind of, it's what we're playing at the time. Really we just have people review what everyone thinks that they're going to have the most fun with. We tried uh, to not take ourselves very seriously. Yeah. Hirashima say fellow otaku, my name is Vernon Shaw. This is so comfortable. Uh, what we did for our field day video is we went through the life cycle of a pepper. From, from growing to the science. We consider ourselves pepper aficionados. At this point, yeah. we know a lot about how peppers work and how hot they get and why, but I've never known the actual science of a pepper. I also got to eat a pepper fresh off the plant for the first time yesterday. Which That's was, cool. Which, but Real nice. It, it was tasty and also horrible. <laughs> Gross. And then we went to a, a restaurant, like a really great restaurant, and talk to a couple of chefs and a manager about like what it's like to cook peppers and work with peppers and why people buy them and eat them in their food. And then we talked to a scientist, that was pretty cool. And then we ate peppers, which was not as cool. Oh! Can we get milk? Oh, it like milk. hurts. Milk. milk to set? It's like stabbing me with a knife in my mouth. And then we ended up in the jacuzzi. It's honestly really great working with such professional people who were so dedicated to creating something unique and cool and great looking. So I can't wait for people to see this. It was nice, it was heartfelt. Real, yeah. Heartfelt. Really, that came from a real place. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, guys. We had a blast working with you, too. Bridget here. Click that box on the left to watch The Life of a Hot Pepper, as told to you by very qualified experts eating habaneros. It's great. And if you already saw it, we also released two other field day videos today. So click to watch Tom Scott explore California City, a place with roads that never grew to the size intended. And we've got a Greyhound short film from the Brothers Rydell. We'll be back with some holiday spectaculars in a few weeks, so don't forget to click subscribe so you don't miss a single one. I'll see you then.